What's up, gamers? Hello, everybody, and welcome to Wii Sports. So, this is around the time that uh, Spencer's hiatus is kind of taking effect, and we kind of don't have uh, Spencer with us here. So, really? um, we, we're going to play some Wii Sports. I know our, some Wii Bowling or Wii Sports has been kind of shoddy lately, because Spencer was the one who liked to do most of the games with us, so... And we won't have Spencer's dad to comment on how much better he is than us. <laughs> I, I, that's still like Mr. Corey. If you're happen. watching, uh, comment down below something. I don't care what it is. Just do it. We don't get comments much. Yeah, we we, we like to see you interact. Yeah. What? So the frickety. Oh, so um, this is probably a good. <laughs> Aiden has left the premises. <laughs> And no. I'm back. All right, we're good. Okay, thanks. We that that brightens my spirits a little bit. <laughs> yeah, I, I don't know. We this bowling is just so oh! different than actual uh, sports, <laughs> I guess. Maybe. Um. There we but go. But anyway, hey, look at that. So I got my wisdom teeth out recently, and um, I I should probably actually show you the video. I've not. Don't believe I've showed you that yet. Oh, uh, me or the channel. Well, either of you. I've not shown you that in... Good point. Just edit it in right here. Alright. Here we can... Boop. That will be the transition. <laughs> but anyway, okay. yeah, so that'll, um... Uh, it, was, it was a nice video, to say the least. I, I was completely fully aware. I didn't say anything, like, too freaking stupid or whatever when I was under it. Um... They, I guess they normally give you nitrous oxide before you go under it because it makes you feel better. And I, I didn't like the effects of it at all, so I said don't give it to me. Ooh. And I guess that's what normally makes you crazy, so I was... My cousin got his uh, wisdom teeth out like two days ago of, of this recording. Um, his video was insane. Like, um, the lady was like, alright, now we're going to walk out to your car. And he's like, I'm not going to walk into it, I'm going to jump into it. So he goes there, <laughs> he's like, hey, watch this. Jumps into the van, <laughs> and she was like, "I literally almost had a heart attack." So he was apparently hilarious. I haven't seen the video yet, but his girlfriend took it, and apparently it was gold. Yeah. So what, gold. what Grant Dupler said. So Grant, if you're watching this, I'm gonna use your thing that you told me because it was freaking hilarious. Um, his brother Ashton had gotten Ast his wisdom teeth out at some Ashton. point. And according to Grant, like, and I quote, I thought Ashton would be funny, but he just threw up. <laughs> so. <laughs> it's just what you do sometimes. <laughs> it's like alcohol, wisdom teeth, like, you know, all, all the same, really. Yeah. What can you do? Speaking of bowling, um, I went bowling with some of my friends from youth group during a youth trip. And it was really fun, because, like, I was actually... I actually got pretty good at bowling. Uh, we played two games, and my highest was like 150, I think. No, it wasn't. It was like 99, actually, now that I think about it. Because I was like talking to this girl, and I was like, hey, look at you. This is your chance to beat me. And then she got a 104. And I was like, you kind of suck now. <laughs> but, uh. That's a good way to get a girlfriend. <laughs> you suck <laughs> at this. No, that was one of my exes. Oh, um, well. <laughs> one of the many. So. Oh! <laughs> so anyway, uh, we're bowling, right? And I found out that the trick to get a strike, you want to get as low to the ground as possible, and then you get a strike. Which I got like three that day. But I got a strike as a spare, because I got a gutter ball, oh. and then a strike, which was really annoying. Oh, the ten pin spares, yeah, yeah. those suck. Well, it's like nice though, because it's like, oh, I didn't actually just completely lose the point. I managed it back, but it's like, I oh, wish I could have done it. And then, um, Tucker got a strike, and you know how, like, the frame after, like, determines, like, if your strike's actually mm -hmm. worth anything? Oh, it's my turn. Yeah. Um, he somehow rolled three gutter balls. <laughs> three gutter balls, because one of our, okay, oh, I should probably mention the gutters. One of them just didn't work, the left one, so, like, if you rolled it at a certain something, it wouldn't hit the back bumper, so you just get another, like, um... What are they called? It's not a frame. Another, uh, like, throw your second yeah, shot. another gun. ball, I guess. Uh, so, and then the right one, if you had a certain amount of spin to it, 
Uh, it would just come back in and knock down more pins. Uh, which I got sometimes. I got five pins from that, I think, once. <laughs> which was great. Um, but yeah, I was like, Tucker, the thing is, you can still let me beat you if you get three gutter balls. And him trying, he got three gutter balls. <laughs> it was the greatest thing I've ever seen. So Tucker, if you're watching this, uh, thank you. Hey, mark my words, we are going to do um, real life bowling with us someday. Yes. We're planning to do maybe maybe not tennis for camera, but we are doing um, real life like we sports. sports basically. We're gonna do golf, well putt putt. Oh, putt -putt. Yeah, we're not we're not doing putt -putt. actual golf. We are doing putt putt though, and then we're gonna do bowling because those are both Frick! Oh, those are both easy ones to do. Not baseball and not boxing, obviously, because. Gotta be kidding me. Oh. Okay, I guess we can do one more. No, we can do multiple more. We're only at six minutes. Oh, frick. So, that was you know, not my we, best we're just blazing through this game. Well, I used to have the high score on here. Nice. Um, anyway, yeah. Oh, we were looking, well, at least I'm looking into doing, like, an actual boat mode from Mario Party. Because Hawking Hills Adventures has, like, a tubing thing that you can do. But if it's just the three of us, we could do a canoe. Because you can fit <coughs> all three in a canoe. Oh, that sucks. Yeah. But that'd be really fun, because we also did that on the youth trip. Uh, we, oh, funny story with that one. I don't know if I told this or not yet. Have it? Has we had a had a recording session since that? I don't know. I feel What's like the we story? I'll tell you. Um, so we're canoeing right down the Hawking Hills River, and um, Bailey brought this fifty foot like rope from like Walmart because we had a midnight Walmart run the last night. So we bought it. So we tied our canoe together with uh, Tucker and Bryson's canoe, <laughs> and we had a six-person canoe team, and it was great. And then we came across Cody Tripp and like the people, frick, Ooh. the people in his canoe, and we were like, "Hey, you guys want to join our canoe party?" And they were like, "Sure." So then we had three canoes, and then we found another person, and then we had four canoes. Then we oh! had fifth. No, we didn't find a fifth person. It was just four. Uh, that was close. Mm -hmm. So that was fun, but then we disbanded, and then we tied off at a rope swing. Uh, that was nice. Um, we okay, yeah. So speaking of the um, tying canoes together, not a good story. I'm not a very really good portion yet. Sorry, I'll go. Let you have fine, that. go. Um, so we dock off. I go once, but it I had like a blister and it popped. Ew. So I was like, eh, I don't really know if I want to do this anymore. So I sit back in the canoe. Brick. That's, so I sit back in the canoe. This is where gamers are born. And uh. There were these drunk, <laughs> frick. Well, there were these drunk kayakers that were also kayaking um, during the same time that we were, I have and three they stories. Docked. And then this lady freaking just flipped out of her kayak, like all of her cigarettes and alcohol. <laughs> um, they like spilled ah! into the river, frick. Um, and I, she was like, "Hey, can you help me? Uh, like, hold all my stuff for me?" So I was like, "Okay," being the nice dude that I am. So I did. Um, <clears throat> And, oh, what was it? Uh, they were, like, cursing up a storm and stuff. And, like, two other, like, sixth graders with me, because we all took a sixth grader with us to, like, make them feel included and stuff. And the one lady was like, dude, you gotta stop cursing. They're, like, 12. And the lady was like, how old are you? I was like, uh, basically 16. She's like, well, they're freaking old enough. But uh, she didn't say freaking. she didn't freaking. say freaking. I was debating on whether to say it or not, but don't, people, don't. people might actually watch it. I was going to say, we, we generally like to stray away from profanity. It's it's. Yeah. I consider it good practice to not like... So, oh, did you hear that the Game Grumps are like, they're censoring out their profanity? Oh, wow, really? Like, the thing is, though, they could just not say the profanity in the first yeah, place. Yeah, that's kind of like... <laughs> yeah. But anyway, okay. your story time. So I actually have three stories that I Holy remembered frick. when you were saying this. So the first one... Is it relates to you canoeing just in general? Oh, so, nice. um, when I went to Florida a few years ago, um, there's like a natural. It's it's not a hot spring. It is literally called a cold spring. It's basically oh. like one of the places where Nestle like bottles their water, I guess. But <laughs> freaking Nestle. Um, we you can like kayak into there, and you come out of this like dirty river into Sorry. like. <laughs> I uh, did not flip off. And just kind of had a seizure there, but um. You come out of this like really muddy and dirty river and you're like the clearest water you've ever seen. And it's also like freaking 40 degrees. 
So even better. I I went there with my aunt and uncle, and apparently, oh jeez, quick. Uh, you can wear like swimming trunks, and I was like, what, what are you wearing swimming trunks for, just in case your kayak gets wet? But no, you literally go swimming inside of this like cold spring. Hmm. I don't think my nipples have ever been harder. Like it, I literally could not go below. I, I couldn't get my junk in the water. It was nice. it was too freaking cold. Wow. Those would have just shriveled right up. <laughs> right, they they, 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 they in my can. body. What? It's possible. What? Yeah. Oh jeez, that's a weird. I'm not saying that it's happened to me before, but it was really weird. If it did happen. If it did, this yeah. is all hypothetical. It's all hypothetical. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't recommend uh, that yeah. experience. That's that should be good. But it w it was really cool. It, I, it was not well, stupid. <laughs> not much of a story. Okay, second story relates to you tying your kayaks together. So, the last when I was in nice. senior year in the youth group, I went to the um, I don't even know what you guys call it, but it's it's the one where you go down the the mountain in the snow. Oh, uh, just Mad River. Mad River Mountain. Yes, yeah. thank you. Um, I went. On oh, I th was I there? You might have been. Yeah, was it yeah, the one yeah, where yeah. literally the were entire year yes. and then like other people tied their like rafts together? It was almost the record for people t uh, like just holding on to each other. And the guy, it was great. yeah, the guy who was like running the thing. You're not supposed to do that, but the guy who was running the thing sounded like the um the one dude from SpongeBob yes. who's like Turkey. the surfer dude. A la Larry? No, not Larry. It was like the, the surfer fish. He was like, oh, 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 oh. Yeah. He literally had like that laugh. We thought he was doing an impression, but that was just his laugh. It was like, it was a great time. Yeah, that was a really good time. Th was Spencer there? I feel like Spencer was there. I don't think he was. You, I know you were there. Yeah. Because I was like... Because I remember it. Well, yeah, that's because you were there. Like, that's why I remember that. But, um... Mm -hmm. that, it was really funny, too. <laughs> Cause I saw like when we like wiped out at the bottom, I saw freaking Merrick McAllister go flying <laughs> off the raft. Like he he got some airtime and landed in someone else's lap. <laughs> um, okay, and then third story was relating to the uh, lady. Frick! On uh, the tenth frame, really? This always happens to me. No, it's me who always gets screwed on the well, tenth. Well, okay. Did I tell you about the time that I got a uh, did I three tell strikes you that I in my tenth frame? Tell a story right now. Oh, <laughs> freaking, freaking. Um, so we were at the Bahamas. This was the um. I went it wasn't really the youth group trip. It was our church trip, the mission trip to the Bahamas. Oh, Blue. we can do one more. We're yeah, at twelve. We we'll just make this a long boy episode. <laughs> I got the bowling badge. Um. Anyway, so we were in the Bahamas. We had like a nice kind of resort thing. Oh, you went on the Bahamas mission trip. I did. Get, yeah, it was. Oh, it was fun. My dad's girlfriend went on that. Oh, nice. Which is weird that she was young enough to go on that trip. Um, yeah, dang, that was like three years ago. That's weird though. That, that was three years ago? Oh, yeah. never mind. It was a different one then. No, it, it was probably the same one. The church did not do that many Bahamas trips. They do mm -hmm. one every four years. Yeah, it must have been one on wild. Year. Maybe my time is off, but... So we were... <laughs> wow, okay. Nice. We were at our... Um, it was like a lazy river water slide resort thing behind our hotel that we were staying at. And uh, it was a really nice place. And um, it was like me and a decent amount of the youth group were just kind of chilling out at this lazy river. And some guy there who was like at the bottom of the water slide just talking. <laughs> we were just kind of talking, chilling out, conversing with him. He's like, oh, yeah, dude, at night I get like super hammered and go down the water slide on my face. <laughs> and we were, we were like I laughing. I had two more stories. So um, it was probably, uh, I think it was like two God, nights later me. at about... Well, that worked. Almost. Well, did it. Oh, this is uh, where gamers are born. No. Oh. Darn, that was close. No, but, I just ruined my strike there, but that's okay. We were hoping to do some um, nice kind of, oh, feel your pain. We we're hoping to do some, like, late night um, lazy river swimming. We even got um, Logan to freaking mm. Logan Hicks to like mm. turn on the lights he like figured out how to get into the electrical box and turn on the lights of like, dude um he's a, he's a madman he <laughs> Logan is a beast but anyway we saw the guy on top of the water slide he's like <laughs> I don't even remember what he said he said whoa I'm something I couldn't even hear and he literally dove onto his face <laughs> and he like poured soap from the restrooms onto the slide and slid all the way the freak down <laughs> 
and where Dave was like laughing at it and Classic Dave. Yeah, well, he was like he was sitting there like dying laughing. He's like, no guys, don't get too close. <laughs> and um we <laughs> we were just watching and all and then we Dave's like, Okay, I think the security guards are coming. We're gonna get out of here. <laughs> and we didn't see that, that guy me. anymore. So yeah, it's you. It was it was an interesting trip. It was the same trip where Dave said, um, dude, I think someone's smoking a doobie downstairs. Classic Dave. Uh, do you hear about the one? Okay, if, okay, yeah. yeah, I got three stories. Do you hear about the one time that um, you might have been there? Bailey said like the like an epic that's what she said joke, and Dave like really laughed at it. Yeah, yeah, I think yeah. I do remember that. Our our youth pastor is great. Dave, okay, he won't laugh at the joke if he doesn't think that you personally need to be saying them, but if he thinks you're cool, then he will, so. Okay. Um, so, okay, story number one, we have a canoe as, like, my family, and one time we were canoeing, it was my sister was there, which was weird, because she's never with us, but it was, like, 30 years ago, uh, and we're canoeing, right, and then we come across, like, this bank, and, like, the, uh, my sister and my brother are on a raft behind us, like, tied to the canoe, and they get stuck in, like, some tree roots or something on the edge, and my sister and brother are freaking out. One, because my sister's a crybaby, and my brother was, like, up nine or something. Um, and everyone was freaking out, except for me, because I'm like, it's water, what are you gonna do, drown? <laughs> everyone was fine, they was just way too traumatic for everyone else or something. Uh, story number two... One time I was camping with Avery Peters, like our family, the Peter family. Do you know Avery? Yeah, I know him decently well, yeah. Yeah. Um, wow. And we were in a hot tub or something, and then like this other guy that we didn't even know came in. And we started talking, and like, uh, he was like, yeah, so you guys ever like shave your wiener? And we were like, what? <laughs> Occasionally. Because I was like 11 at the time, the so I didn't even like, have anything like... there. <laughs> Okay, the thing is, I'm not... Never mind. I'm not <laughs> Let's just uh, um, ignore that. that. <laughs> but it, he, it was really weird. I think that I added him on Instagram or something. Um, oh, it was just after... Okay, so I had, like, jumped into the uh, pool at the Deer Creek um, Lodge. Okay. But I remembered that I had my phone in my pocket. Oh. So I uh, totally just screwed over an iPhone 6S, and I had to, like, work the whole summer to, like, pay it back. Um... But, so that was awful, and like the worst part like of camping that I've ever had. Um, I was really close to doing that. It was like some mission mm -hmm. trip we took up to, uh, it was the one where we took to East Liverpool. Do you remember the youth group doing that? I didn't go on it. I was, well, you wouldn't have. You would have yeah. been too young, but, because um, I was like a freshman when we did it, but we went to East Liverpool, we went to some like wave pool afterward, mm -hmm. and um, I had my phone in my pocket. I was literally up to the bottom of my pocket in the water. I'm like, oh, crap. So I sprinted out of the water. Mm -hmm. But it was like, wow. it was less than an inch away from touching my phone. It was, it was yeah, like, now I'm very sheer heart attack with my phone um, everywhere. Oh, uh, quick story. So David, um, my mom's fiance, um, he, we had to go to this pool party or something because he has friends that had one. And he, there was like this uh, dice pool toy. He's like, all right, if this is the number that I'm thinking of, um, uh, Sarah, my mom, has to jump in. <laughs> I was like, you're going to tell any of us the number so then we know what it is. So then we just, you're not like cheating. He's like, nah, <laughs> just trust me. So I was like, okay. So it's like, if it lands on the number that I think it is, then I have to push you in. He's like, okay. So I just picked every number. <laughs> uh, and then I just jumped in with him. It was great. Um, cause he's he's nice, but like, I don't know. Don't push my mom to the pool. That doesn't get. Oh, you beat me. me. You just that that beat me there. Nice. Yes. One eighty three. Wow, we like speed ran bowling there. Mm -hmm. This is a really long episode, though. Hey, story hey. time. All right. If well, you guys stick stuck to the end, subscribe. Um, I'm gonna end this so it's exactly yeah. twenty minutes. So, so keep going, keep going. How long is the outro?